Welcome to Marina's Kitchen. Today I'm going to make something very easy and quick. My hand is getting much better. I can handle more things with it, but I don't like to do a lot of cutting, a lot of uh, forcing to do that, a bit of extra that I can't afford to do. I've got to get it better before I can go the whole way. They still been a bit better. Uh, what I do is I'm going to give you, I'm going to make an eggplant pizza for you today. Very easy and very beautiful, okay? Now I've got a lovely big eggplant like this. You can get a nice big size one. I've cut the sides off it and what I've got, I've got three beautiful pieces like that. They're lovely, you can have more if you want to, but I'm just going to do three for you today. Okay, there's three lovely pieces like that. Now what we do is we put we put some nice, I don't use the pizza sauce on it. I like to have this new, this lovely Mutiti, M-U-T-T-I vegetable and Palestinian cheese through it. This has got all the flavour that you want in it. It's got everything in it so you don't need anything extra flavour. You don't need any extra salt or pepper because it's got a beautiful flavour. What you do is, what I do is I spray, I'm going to spray them like with some virgin oil. And I got, I'm going to spray a, a baking paper here because I'm going to bake them in there in the baking about to about quarter of an hour, 20 minutes. Okay, so just put that on the top like that. Beautiful. We don't, as I said, we don't need extra salt or pepper because this has got a lot of flavour to it, a lot of flavour to it. And it's beautiful. Just keep on adding enough there to put on everything. And then we're going to put some bacon on the top and I'm going to have a couple of olives. We're going to have an eggplant pizza. Very lovely, very different. Okay, just keep on doing the same thing. This is a lovely flavoured tomato thing. It's beautiful. And you can, you can use this for making a pasta sauce, or a pasta sauce is beautiful. Okay, look. Just put a little ear on the, around the sides. Like that, keep on going like that. I'm just going to spread it all. Take about a half of this jar for three pieces. I've done two pieces for you to show you and I've got another three here to do and you get a nice big eggplant, you get a nice big eggplant. So there you go, that's what you want to do. Just to give that beautiful thing. Now what I've got here, I've got some bacon. Chopped bacon, just put a couple of pieces of chopped bacon on top like that. I'll have to use this hand because I can't use that hand very much. I'll just put it some chopped, it's only about a hundred gram of chopped bacon here you have. Just have something you've got inside. Just put that bacon across there, you don't want a lot, just put it added. We've got some nice prosciutto to put on top of it also, so just put that bacon like that across there. Just to fill it up. Okay, that's it. Now I'm going to put a couple of little, just, a, just one, two, three. That's all I'm going to put. I'm not going to put over a lot of olives. One, two, just across the, the eggplant. Just to give it that extra flavour. Just a couple of the, that's all. A couple of olives. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some lovely prosciutto on top. This beautiful prosciutto hang. I'm going to slice it on there like that, like that and put it on the top like that. This is a beautiful prosciutto that gives it an extra flavour to it. You can use it up. I've got here about three or four pieces. I'm just going to use it up by putting it through there like that. And I've got another bit here, so I may as well use it all up. Put it some more here, because that will just melt in the oven. That'd be lovely. I'm going to use it all up. You can put as much as you like on it. But it's just lovely, it just melts in the oven after, it just melts down. So I'm just going to put that lovely prosciutto around there. And now I'm going to put some mozzarella cheese on top. I've sliced the mozzarella cheese in slices and I'm going to put about a couple of slices on each, each pizza, eggplant pizza. I'm going to put two pieces like that. I've already got my oven on 200, it is a nice hot oven. And about 15 to 20 minutes you can have a look when they're ready. And just put that lovely sliced mozzarella on the top like that. Two pieces will do. There you've got your eggplant pizza. 
I, I think I should, you should try it with a very nice. I'm going to show you what I've done. I've cooked two. I'm going to show you my cooked ones that I did. Okay, now I'm going to put these in. I got the spray. I sprayed some oil on the paper, baking paper. Just put them across there like that. Just there, cut that. Now just on a 200 degrees oven with about 15 to 30 minutes, and you've got this beautiful eggplant pizzas. They are so nice. You can use them any way you want to. Now this is what I've got here. I've got here. I, I baked my two pieces of eggplant pizzas. Just cut them in. I can't even cut them properly because of my hand. And just cut them across there like that. You can eat them with a steak or what. And they're beautiful. Look at that. Look how nice that is. That's a beautiful eggplant pizza. It, the eggplant just cooked very nice with that cheese and a couple of olives. Look, I, I hope that I, this is something easy because I've just got to do easy things for now until my hand gets better. But I hope you'll try them. They are really nice. They're something different. So I've got my, my eggplant pizzas to show you today. Okay? Have a great day. Thank you for watching my video. Bye.